Rohingya Muslims are facing the worst genocide in recent history. Men, women, children are being slaughtered, burnt alive, along with the villages. Women and children are being raped by Myanmar army and Buddhists. Those that have managed to escape have fl all fled to Bangladesh. Some are stuck in no man's land. We have now more than one million Rohingya Muslims in Bangladesh, which include thousands of children whose parents were killed, thousands of women who are pregnant because they were raped by Myanmar army. Some of them have now have HIV. My uncle went to the Rohingya camps and um, he saw with his own eyes. Also one of my friends who, who is a journalist who works for a Bangla News Channel. Uh, young, Rohingyan, young Rohingyan men carried their disabled parents from Myanmar to Bangladesh. As far as I know, every journalist, aid worker, ordinary people who went there in the Rohingya camps cried their eyes out. Why is this happening to Rohingya Muslims? The answer is Gog and Magog. Allah spoke in the Quran and he said in the Ajuja Majuja Mufsiduna fill up that Gog and Magog will perpetrate, perpetrate facade on us. Our great grandparents, our ancestors had to crawl on the earth before the British imperial masters. They had to go down and bend their knees and their hands like animals to start to crawl before a British imperial master and lord because they insisted on that. So the war on our people has been continuing for a long, long time. The same kind of rape and plunder and killing and massacre that's taking place in this part of the world compares with the impoverishment of the masses around the world to riba. And our people are suffering, they are in destitution. Masses all around the world. Do not study the Rohingya, Rohingya subject in isolation. No. There are massacres taking place so many other parts of the world, they just don't mention it. And there is suffering, including the Palestinian people in Gaza, who are now on the verge of collapse. And our prophet told us that these things will happen. We don't have to look for an answer why, because the Quran told us why it's happening. In fact, there's more to come. The Arabs are going to be destroyed. This is the Rohingya. What is coming to the Arabs is worse. So are you going to ask me tomorrow, why are the Arabs suffering like this? Yeah? This is what the Quran has said and said, this is Gog and Magog. Now those who are resisting Gog and Magog, we at least have some credentials. We are having some credentials that we are looking forward to the, the, the day when we can protect our people when Imam al-Mahdi comes, inshallah, and we regain power in the world, the Khilafah state is restored. But what about those who wage the bogus jihad in Syria? Taking weapons from Saudi Arabia, which is hand in glove with the Gog and Magog world order. And then they want to condemn me, saying that I am supporting Assad. And Assad is a dog, and Assad is a cat, and Assad is a louse, and Assad is this, and Assad is that, and Assad is the other. And you are supporting Gog and Magog, you are hand in glove with Gog and Magog, you are taking weapons from the CIA, you are taking American dollars to wage your bogus jihad, and you want to have me say you are people worthy of respect. I say to you, you are not Muslims. I say to you, you have left Islam. I say to you, if you die in that bogus jihad, I will not pray over your body. And I'll never stand at your grave. You traitors. But you were brainwashed. And now you realize that you were brainwashed and you don't know how to get out of your predicament. The answer is that you must make toba. Yes, toba. And separate yourself from that evil world. That world which is causing that Rohingya massacre. And, and they're sending the money to support the massacre. They're paying, they're the pay masters. The same people who gave you the weapons to go to Syria are the same people who are paying for the Rohingya massacres to continue. Same people. The same people who are giving you the US dollars. 
to go and wage your bogus jihad are the same people who are paying for the Rohingya massacre to continue all the time. Same people doing it. So you are the ones we have to condemn. Not Gog and Magog, because we know about Gog and Magog in the Quran. You who have joined with them and left the Ummah of Muhammad wasalam, and now you are embarrassed because you went to Syria and you killed so many people and you've come back to the Western world. And you want to condemn me because I, I expose you for what you have done. You bogus jihad. You're not going to be part of our ummah until you make tawbah for what you've done. And seek Allah's forgiveness for what you've done. And stop this bogus jihad in Syria. If Russia had not intervened, Syria would have become another Libya. And you would have celebrated if Syria had become another Libya, because you are in the camp of Gog and Magog. That's it. We pray that Allah may protect us from you. Do you have any advice for Bangladesh government? Because they they already um, done a lot for Rohingya. Um, I Rohingya cannot means. comment. I cannot comment. Uh, I cannot comment on the Bangladeshi government and its policies on that subject because I don't have enough knowledge. Okay.